Hello! Today we will be learning about a computer program called Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word allows you to create, share, send, and print documents in an organized manner. Using this program is more efficient than writing. It helps you save time with the click of a button. Let's take a look at the screen. The upper right-hand corner features three icons, the Minimize, the Restore or Maximize, and the Close buttons that are commonly found in all Microsoft Office programs. The Minimize button, the Dash, when clicked temporarily moves the Microsoft Word application to the bottom of your computer screen. The application can be recovered by clicking on the box on the taskbar. The Restore or Maximize button, the two squares, when clicked, shrinks the application to a smaller box and then maximizes the application to full screen size when clicked again. But beware, the close button, the X, when clicked, closes out of the application completely. But have no fear, if you haven't yet saved your work, Microsoft Word will prompt you to save your close action. Saving your work means that a copy of your document will be permanently placed in a file on your computer. Saving a document allows you to continue working on your document at a later time. You should always save your work. The Save function is located here in the Office button on the upper left-hand toolbar. The most important functions in the Office button are New, Open, Save, Save As, and Print. By clicking on the word New, a box will appear and prompt you to create a blank document. You must click on the word Create. Once you do this, a new blank document will appear. By clicking on the word Open, you can open up previously saved files that are stored on your computer. Another window will open and allow you to select the document you wish to continue working on. By clicking on the word Save, you can make sure your work is permanently kept on the computer. Saving your documents is extremely important, so all of your hard work does not disappear. By clicking on the word Save As, you can save your work in another section of your files or change the name of your document. By clicking on the word print, it opens another menu that gives you the option of printing. Printing allows you to take a physical copy of your document with you. You can also preview what you will be printing. Just click on the Office button and hover your mouse over the print option, then select Print Preview. If you are satisfied with your finished document, you can press the Print button. If you are unsatisfied and would like to edit your document, select the Close Print Preview button and edit as necessary. In addition to all of the things that you can do, Microsoft Word is smart too. It tries to assume what you are typing. For example, look at what happens when we try to type the date. It automatically enters the date by pressing Enter. To increase or decrease the size of the document, you can use the zoom bar located at the lower right-hand corner of the screen. After learning about the Office button, this toolbar is called the Ribbon. The Ribbon contains many functions that we will learn about later on in the video. You will notice in the upper left-hand corner of your screen several icons. These are little pictures of some of the functions that we have previously discussed. And remember, if you ever have any problems, always consult the Help button located on the upper right-hand corner of the screen.